What is going on, everybody? It is your homie, your boy, Sam Whisper here, guys. I just wanted to make a quick video for you guys because if you guys are like me, I bought Liza P on the Xbox Game Pass, or I had the Xbox Game Pass, I'm sorry, and I played it basically from there. Uh, beat the game, got it, I already had a new game plus going, but that was, like, I think I played that in 2023, I beat it in 2023. So now, as you guys already know, Liza P Overture is coming out real soon, and I want to make a quick video just to show you guys really quick how to take your save files from your Xbox Game Pass and bring it over to your Steam if that's what you want to do. Um, of course, if you bought it on Xbox, of course, you don't even need it. So you just can continue to play it from there. But if you're like me, I decided to go ahead and buy it on Steam because it was a lot more cheaper to buy it on Steam. And yeah, and I bought all my save files over from there. So with that being said, let's go ahead. Let's jump right into it. Let's go. All right, guys. So we're going to go ahead and start here first of all the name of the github is called xgp it is an extractor basically it what it does it goes into the memory of the uh game pass and it goes and it basically grabs that them save files and yeah and puts it into uh the format that it needs to go into in order for you to be able to pull it and bring it over to, to Steam. I'm gonna have all that down here in the description below, guys. So make sure you got on the description. It'll go straight into it. And then, yeah, just follow me from here. So what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna go ahead and download the XGP Save Extract XE, right? Once it saves, you're gonna go ahead and just open it up. You're gonna go ahead and run it. Now, as you can already see, I've already done, done it right here already. So once you actually get it started up, I'll just do it again. Mine tells me, be, you know protect but it's fine guys i promise you so it's gonna run it's going to get everything you need it's gonna go back so as you can see uh it goes from my expedition 30 uh three that i'm playing right now and also my liza p but once you guys so again once you guys see everything fully downloads here right it goes my clear as we care does download my liza p which you see right here so i'm gonna go ahead and jump over to my downloads folder, which is be right here, right? And so this is my Liza P uh, extraction right here. So my auto saves, um, save data, my character saves in it. So all I'm gonna do is, all I'm gonna do is make sure you guys go on your Steam account. So go to my Steam account, go to my library. I'm gonna go ahead down to Liza P real quick. Go ahead and go to my Liza P right now. I'm gonna gonna right click gonna go to properties real quick and then we're gonna go to install file and then we're gonna go ahead and go to browse we're gonna go Liza P and then gonna go to save now I want to back up a little bit because I want to make sure you guys know this you guys have to play the game real quick and when I mean play the game real quick I mean literally quick so what you're gonna do is you're gonna start Liza P up on your um, here on your Steam account once you do that, gonna go ahead and run it all the way till you get to your first save spot. Then after that, you can jump out. So you're gonna play the game like it's a brand new game, go through it real quick, do the first game, you know, you gotta, you gotta go through the little town and you gotta beat the little guy, the, the little mini boss on the side, get through the gate. The first, um, the first star glazer is right there. Get in there, save it, jump out. Once you, once you jump out guys, then you guys are gonna see this. You guys are going to see your save game here. Once you open it, go to go to save games again. Three or eight, and you guys can see it here. So it is the exact same thing here. And so what you're going to do is go back to your downloads folder where your Liza P is already. Double click. You're going to just take this, and you're literally going to just drag and drop. That's it. Of course, your 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 uh, computer is going to ask you, "Hey, you want to?" Uh, overwrite these files yes you do right you want to overwrite those files so that way your files can just get transferred over and that's it y'all that's it so um i did find out i did find out that for some reason when i was downloading this i've been having liza p on my computer for quite a while so i never uninstalled it on on the uh xbox even though it's been gone for a minute and i noticed that the program didn't really want to run it if it wasn't installed so that may be something that you may have to go against now if there's another way maybe some of you guys may know or if i do find out another way i would definitely let you guys know because I, I would think that there's some other way you could do it but until then um 
as far as I know, as long as you got it installed on your Game Pass, which some of you may not because, right, it's no longer on the Game Pass anymore, you may have a hard time. But if not, let me know down in the comments below if you guys did it and it still worked or is it giving you the error, which is right here when it says, like Fair says, I don't, I did, I don't have Wulong Fallen Dice anymore. It says no containers for this game. Maybe the game is not installed anymore. Or maybe there's a certain spot you can go to to find those um, those save files. So uh, if I find out anything, of course, I will let you guys know. But I just want to give you guys a heads up of how to do this. You guys are awesome. Thank you guys so much for taking your time out to come and check out this video. Also, I am a live streamer here on YouTube, guys. We will be um, playing Liza P Overture when it does come out because it's one of my favorite Souls games. And I, I just think they, uh, Neo Wiz had did such a wonderful job on the first one. I cannot wait to see what the DLC is bringing out as well. So, but thank you guys so much. Again, I'm, sorry, I'm a live streamer here on YouTube. I stream went Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. Do you guys have any questions? Come hang out with me. Come check me out from 6 o'clock to 10 o'clock p.m. So, you guys have yourself a wonderful night, and I'll see you guys next time, man. Peace.